Hello YouTube, welcome to my channel and today we are going to go through some more vintage comic books and today's subject is She-Hulk. I will go through my run of the She-Hulk and then I'll talk about some of the prices that I paid and I will of course at the end show you the current values as they're going on eBay. We'll start with She-Hulk. Well, this is Savage She-Hulk, not Sensational She-Hulk. Savage She-Hulk came out in the late 70s, early 80s, like 79, 80. As you can see, this one is from 1980, and this is issue number 10. And then later on, they had another run of since of She-Hulk called Sensational She-Hulk, and it was more flippant. This is the very first run, and... It is much more, well, savage, really. <laughs> She's much more like the Incredible Hulk than she is in Sensational She-Hulk. In Sensational She-Hulk, they girled her up a bit and made her a lot more uh, uh, attractive in a fashionable kind of sense. This is issue number nine. As you can see, this has a $5 price tag, but I definitely didn't pay $5 for this. We have... Issue number eight, and I believe this one is Man-Thing, this kind of hulking creature behind her. And issue number seven here, where she's battling some swamp demons. And She-Hulk got her powers uh, because she's actually the cousin of Bruce Banner. Jennifer Walters is a lawyer. She's the cousin of Bruce Banner. And she, either through some car accident or one of the people that she threw in jail or some sort of combination of the two, they came after her. They almost killed her. And she needed an immediate blood transfusion. This is where Iron Man comes in, in issue number six. She needed uh, a blood transfusion. And the only person who was around was Bruce Banner, and I guess he was a blood match, but I don't know how he could have been a blood match considering that he was so radioactive from all of his green Hulk blood. I don't know, but somehow he was a match because, you know, they're related, and he was able to save her life by giving her a blood transfusion, but it made her into the Hulk. However, she is not, uh, she's a lesser Hulk Hulkified version of the Hulk, less, less super angry and less out of control than he is. And here, this one says, my father, my foe, where her father doesn't know that she's actually, that Jennifer is actually the She-Hulk, and so he's kind of coming after her. Yeah, because he's the sheriff, and so he's unaware that he's facing his own daughter in a fight to the death. It's always so dramatic. <laughs> issue number three. And as you can see, she gets punched out of a window. And I have two copies. And most of these, especially issue number one through five, I got from eBay. I got about eight, seven or eight of them from eBay eBay for about $35 to $40 from one particular seller and it was just a lucky win on an auction that I won. And here is number two, issue number two. And then the rest of these that I got, I I got for less than three dollars, a dollar fifty here, a dollar sixty five there, a dollar twenty seven there. I keep an Excel spreadsheet that tells me exactly how much I um, purchase things for. Here's another set of issue number two. As you can see, I have a number of different of issue number twos in various conditions, but they're all pretty really good condition. And here. This is it, the number one collector's item issue. And the reason why you want Savage She-Hulk number one is number one, it's an homage cover. This is an homage cover to the Incredible Hulk number one. And then number two, there's Stan Lee proudly presents the She-Hulk lives. Stan, Stan Lee was involved in the creation of the She-Hulk. This is either the last character that he was involved in the creation of or one of the very last characters. And 
it's also one of those it's rare things where it's the first issue and it's the first appearance of the character in the first issue in the first and the first time the character is in the title duh because it's the first issue so all of those things kind of converge together to make this a pretty special item and it's been going up um, at a pretty fast clip on eBay and I'll delineate the values in just a moment but I love She-Hulk this is the character that I really grew up reading uh, Wonder Woman, She-Hulk, Captain Marvel, the X-Men, Alpha Force and Alpha Flight but really really it was mostly She-Hulk and and Wonder Woman so um, this brings back a lot of childhood memories even though um, I wasn't really reading this in 1979 I came to it a little bit later I'm not that old <laughs> bye oh I forgot to state as I always state there is a disclaimer I work for Warner Brothers and we have a licensing deal with DC this is Marvel and not DC but I still do want to give the disclaimer that I uh, my channel is not associated in any way shape or form with Warner Brothers or DC or Marvel or anything like that no one's asked me to do this this is just my personal collection and it's something that I've done since before the time that I worked at Warner Brothers bye for real this time